Good evening, everyone. This is Francis. It's 8 17 p.m. in Cypress, Texas. What we're looking at is the blink of 20 images that I took with Gross 004 using the coordinates I gathered from the International Astronomical Union. This is zoomed in a little bit to the image. Uh, I'll decrease it out. I'll go out. That is the original size right there. And there are 20 images that we're scrolling through. And in this star field, I need to find YU55. And I see things, you know, I see artifacts showing up. I don't know if one of the artifacts is the asteroid zipping by. So I'll zoom in. Normally when we take pictures, the center of the image is the, the point of where you want to pay attention to. So that zoomed into the beginning of the image. I see something light up over here. That's there's twenty images. There's got a lot of images to float through. But um I don't see it right off the bat. I have more points. I'll take some more images. I'm going to pull up the color ones and see what those look like. But this is the uh, the clear filter on the Gross 004. That is a star field over 20 images. We have image artifacts that will show up here or there. I don't know if one is uh, the the if I don't know if I'm missing it somewhere. So this is first look. These are my first images out in space tonight. Oh, I saw a streak over there. I did see a streak. I know I saw a streak in one of my images earlier. There is a streak in one. Let's look over here. Let's look over here, see if a streak shows up. I don't know what it's supposed to look like. I know that when we've been looking at... Look, there's a streak right there. Oh, that might have been it right there. Let's see. We're going to see another streak over here. Oh, and then I see a spot there. What's that? What's that? That's something coming into view. That's a streak. That might be. <laughs> Here it comes again. Let's. Uh, I don't see. My problem is I can't. I can't really zoom over there. I can't zoom in there and then get over there. See, I'm already out of it. I'm not in a position to where I can scroll from side to side. And. Uh, I can't move it over. No, I can't move it over. I don't know what my issue is. I don't know what I'm dealing with. No, I can't do that. So let's go back out. There it is right there. And is that the object? See, if that's it, out of 20 frames, I'm lucky I took 20 frames because if that's all... The, well, see, I saw two things. I saw a streak and a white. Now let's, let's look at that again. Let's see if we can follow. Where else is it going to be? Do... Is there another one? Let's look down here. Is there another one somewhere? Uh, gosh, I can't see nothing. I do see a streak. I don't see anything moving across the. These these were these were exposed for 15 seconds. 20 images at 15 seconds. It's not very long. Maybe that's it. It shows a line and a dot shows up right there. I know the white dots show up in a lot of places. I'm gonna have to look at this. See what was that? Oh, I was. My eyes were getting to me. I'm sorry. I thought I saw something streak across in front of it. There's the streak. Let me get my darn thing out of the way. See, there's anything come in from over here? I don't know, people. But it's normal. I mean, that that's an object. That That is definitely... That streak is something. But now, what is it? Where does it go? And what's going on? Can we see it any farther than that streak? No, because, see, my image is only 15 seconds, and then it's probably gone when the next one starts. There's a break in the middle. Okay, I'm going to stop now. Let's get back. We're going to look at the color ones. Maybe the color ones have the same streak. I don't know. Let's find out.